let's talk about parallelograms, area, and perimeter. A parallelogram's perimeter, that's the distance around, I apologize, that's the distance around the parallelogram is two times A plus two times B, where A and B are side lengths. Now for the area, you just have base times height. Now notice that the height right here is not actually a side length. It's got this dotted line. Your height is always perpendicular to your base. So wherever you see this perpendicular line uh, cutting through your parallelogram, you know that's your height. Let's look at this one. It says find the area. Well, our first question is, well, I know I'm going to use the 13. It's going to be 13 times something. But should I be dealing with the 9 or should I be dealing with the 6? Well, for area, it's your base times your height. In this case, our height, the thing that's forming the right angle, that's the 6. So the 9 is useless to us. Uh, 13 times 6 will give us our answer. And that's going to give me 78. Look at this one. It says find the area. Again, we need to determine what numbers to use. Now, I see the right angle happening here. So I know that's my height and that's my base. 17 times 6. That's going to give me my answer. And that is 102. Now, this one it says find the perimeter. Now, perimeter, we want that distance all the way around, which means I don't care about this 3. I just care about the 14 and the 5. So my perimeter, or that's the 2a plus 2b formula. So in this case, perimeter is 2 times 14 plus 2 times 5, uh, which is 28 plus 10, which is 38. This one asking for perimeter again, so that's that distance all the way around. We don't care about the four, that's my height. So we'll have two times 10 plus two times 16, which is 20 plus 32, which is 52. That's all for area and perimeter of parallelogram. 